do this. Hey guys, what's up? Sorry for the echo. We are in a very big room right now because our house is hot as hail. So we're still trying to figure out a place for us to film for our family channel, like our intros and stuff. So just bear with us. But welcome to our Glamour Family channel. This is our first ever video and as promised, this is a big video for us uh, and for you guys too. This is going to be our baby name reveal video where we're going to be revealing the name of our little prince that's going to be here in just a few weeks. He could be here any day now. We're just playing the waiting game, but as of right now, he's just chilling. Before we get into this video, we're going to tell you guys how we came up with the name and then we are going to go into the actual name reveal and hopefully you guys enjoy this video if you aren't already subscribed to this channel please hit that subscribe button because we are going to be filming a lot more together david is still a little bit chai <laughs> well because i know how to do this and like so i'll give you your minute to shine okay i will be featuring more of the boys david julian and our new boy to come. I uh, y'all thought I was gonna say his name, but I'm not. <laughs> We're gonna go into how we picked out the name. I know that that's gonna be a huge question. So David, take it away. We had a name originally that kind of sounded like the name we actually did pick out. Yeah. So it was a little bit more popular than I would like it to be. Yeah. I wanted something a little bit more unique. And also it was the name of a Cowboys player and into that so just for that I should just name <laughs> just, that just to I'm, spite you when I'm just talking stuff <laughs> just yeah, yeah on the words of Jimmy yeah grab my hand maybe yeah. fine the second one I don't know we're just like it's, it's similar in a way but it's a little bit shorter yeah and as easy as it is to spell my family still messes it up <laughs> all the time so, it's not that hard man <laughs> how can you guys not spell this name before we got pregnant we had I mean just like played around with names we've been together for so long um, and I always loved the name Ezekiel now this is not what we ended up naming him but that was definitely something that I mean honestly up until we picked his name we were so sure that we were gonna be naming our son Ezekiel and we were gonna call him Zeke now if you guys don't know there is a Cowboys player named Ezekiel Elliot, I feel like that may he's have good. been a huge. I, I, he's I, good. He I'm is like, good. He's, he's good. an amazing player. Um, but and my brother was really excited, you know, calling him Zeke or whatever. Gabriel. Gabriel was another one. Yes, Gabriel was another one. I've always loved the name Gabriel. I've always thought it was such a beautiful name, and so I was. It was between Ezekiel and Gabriel. We picked up this name, his actual name. Uh, before we even knew that he was a boy. We didn't even consider girl names, really. I had one that I was like, if we have a girl, we're most likely gonna name her this, and it was that fast, too. Um, but I wanna save that just in case. Just in, yeah. <laughs> just in yeah, case. We, we, gotta, we gotta save content for another <laughs> Right? Just in case. The views. Yeah. He doesn't really want a girl. I think it just, the concept of having a girl scares him. Yeah. But we, babe, I don't know. I feel like we always knew that he was going to be a boy. Plus, early on, we went to that appointment and they kind of. Yeah, we so like they, two months pregnant. Yeah. We really knew pretty much what it was. They kind of ruined yeah. the surprise a little bit. They look at the skin on the back of the neck and they can measure it. And based on that measurement, they can tell whether or not your baby has the chance of having Down syndrome. So I had gone in to go get that test. And so that day, David was like really busy with work, I couldn't come. To this appointment but it wasn't supposed to be anything like a big appointment so it was fine just by the way that he was moving the ultrasound tech basically she was like i probably bet you money that this is a boy we still weren't sure she told me you know like there was still like a 50 50 percent chance but to be real with you guys we kind of had an idea that he was going to be a boy yeah we just abandoned or, anything girl related at that yeah point. so like i said that was around two to three months that was like in february right yeah. Before the wedding. Yeah. Immediately started thinking about finalizing a name. Now at this point, we thought it was going to be between Gabriel and Ezekiel. Then one night, I know I talk a lot. Go ahead. Well, you said it. You're like, well, what about this one? And then I was like, yeah, that sounds really good. See, this is why I don't let him like well, tell it because he's not a storyteller. So what happened? 
happened was That's what happens. we were laying in bed one night. Spice on it. No, it's it's really what happened. You're just it's like, like so worried like about it. Gone. It was not the shut up. So uh, we were laying in bed one night, and I was actually on the computer, and I was looking up the meanings of these names that we had picked out: Ezekiel and Gabriel. Yeah, we wanted to go with the biblical. Yes. I started looking up, you know, the meaning of Gabriel and the meaning of Ezekiel and like the background stories of both of those names. And in the process, we happened to find another name that I had been thinking about previously. What in the hell are you doing? I'm looking up his name. You don't know the meaning of his name? I told you the meaning of his name. I know we went over it, but I forgot. Okay. You all cut up? on the name that your son is going to have in about two weeks? Yeah, no, keep doing what you're doing. Type. Like okay, this. cool. I had heard this name like a few times, one or two times, and I absolutely fell in love with it. And I told David, what do you think about this name? And honestly, I just said it very lightheartedly. I didn't think that it was going to be anything that we were going to decide on just because we were mostly, I mean, 90% leaning towards Ezekiel. Um, but I just said it just like, you know, let's consider it. And we both absolutely fell in love with it. His middle name was extremely easy to pick out. It, it was like a no-brainer. So the first name and the middle name just went really, really well together. And that is how we came up with his name. It literally took about five minutes, I would say. My mother, my brother, our family, like they love it. But like he said, his family is having a little bit of a hard time spelling it. So yeah. it, it takes a minute, number one. And number two, you don't hear it that often. Yeah. It is kind of unique. I'll give him that, but once, I mean, if you hear it, like, it's obvious how it's spelled. Yeah, I mean. I mean, there's no silent letter in it. I mean, <laughs> so, uh, anyways, without further ado, I will not have you guys waiting any longer. I know you guys are so excited to know what the name of our new little boy is, but I just wanted to give you guys a little bit of a backstory and also get you guys used to seeing David. He's going to be on this channel a hell of a lot more. He's going to be helping me behind the scenes as far as like editing and things like that. We're going a whole other direction and I'm really excited about this channel. If you guys aren't aware, uh, we do have an Instagram page for this channel. It is Glamour Life YT, like for YouTube, um, on Instagram. And I went through that follow list and randomly picked some of my Glamazons to help with revealing the name. So I hope you guys enjoy. And without further ado, let's get on to the name reveal. <laughs> you really practiced that. <laughs> Hey Nikki, I'm Aaliyah Frazier from Oklahoma and my letter was A. I love you guys so much and your page is so inspiring and I just can't wait to watch you guys' family grow and a lot more things to come in the future. Hi everyone, my name is Sharina, I'm from Italy and I'm Sri Lankan and the letter that I got is the letter I. And I wish our baby Glamazon all the best in life and I wish he lives a long, happy, healthy life and I can't wait to meet him. Hi, I'm Chloe. I'm from Plano, Texas. I was presented with the letter D and I wanted to congratulate you guys and say to the baby boy, I hope you have a happy and healthy life and we'll all love you as a family. So congratulations again and thank you. My name is Jasmine Bermudez, I am from San Diego, California, and I got the letter Z. My message to you would be that I hope you accomplish everything you set your mind to. I hope you have a very happy life full of lessons and joy, and I truly believe that you can have a blessed with a better mom, a better dad, and a better big brother, and a family of Amazon that truly loves you and wishes nothing but the best for you. Hi, Nikki, David, and Julian. I'm Chantel. This is Olivia. You're from London, Ontario, Canada, and the letter you guys gave us for Baby Glamour is me. We are so beyond excited to meet you, Baby Glamour, and to Nikki, we hope you have a beautiful safe delivery, and we can't wait to see future videos. Thank you. My name is Haley Rohr and I am from Stewart, Virginia and my letter is R. And Nikki, I hope that your baby is blessed with many opportunities and gets all the love in the world. Hey guys, I'm Hope. 
I'm from St. Louis, Missouri, and the letter I have today for Baby Glam is on is E. I'm so, so excited to finally virtually meet him and find out the name and all that good stuff, but more importantly, I'm excited to watch David and Nikki continue to be the amazing parents they've already been to Julian, and I think it's so sweet how they're extending their family, but allowing us to be a part of it, and yeah, I just wanted to send all my love and best wishes to you guys. Enjoy your blessing. Okay, love you guys. Bye.